What's up guys, welcome back to the Gaming Pond. So I made a mistake. Um, I accidentally deleted the video for chapter one of the parts in chapter two. And I'm going to go ahead, It's gonna, this one's going to be a short one, but I'm going to go ahead and go through the story part of it. I'm not going to worry about any of the battles. So we'll go ahead and begin here, which is where I left off from the last part. An enemy unknown. Absolute power. Those things, they appear to have assumed our forms. Or were created by Kuja to look like us. Back on our world, he often created soldiers to do his bidding. The thing is, even if he did make them, how did he know what all, the f all of us look like? And also, why go through all the trouble? There is always the terror, the possibility that the specters were in no way related to Kuja. Whatever the case, we must be very careful, Kupo. Whoever is behind this extremely is extremely dangerous. We also need to find the rest of these monsters and destroy them before they cause any problems. Don't worry, we'll get rid of them. Yeah, we need to stop them before they reach our home. Yes, Koopa, I'm counting on you. Okay. <laughs> An escape route. Look, I bet this will take us back. If there's a way in, there's got to be a way out, huh? But it might not lead back to the same world we came from. At least Kuja seems to be gone. Shall we continue forward? But wait, Kujo knows how to manipulate torsions and move between them. How do we know he didn't create this one? There's only one way to find out. <clears throat> Kuja, what are you planning? Are you okay? Yes, I'm just worried. He hurt a lot of my friends back home. Don't worry, Vivi. It's not going to happen again because you won't let it. Just remember to stand strong and keep going no matter what happens. I will. Thank you, mister. Mister? Are the two of you coming? We'll be right there. Come on, Vivi. Right behind you. A reason to live. I come from a world called Orients. There, when you die, you also cease to exist in people's memories. And there's no way you can transfer your life's memories to others. That's terrible. What's the point of even living if you're going to be forgotten? It was done so that those left behind wouldn't have to suffer. It's the crystal's will. That said, we fear death just the same as any of you. And so Kuja attempts to defy fate. In our world, each of us is given a life purpose, a destiny, if you will, by cosmic beings similar to those you call gods. Me and Zidane and Kuja are just like you. Have you ever attempted to defy your fate? Have you, mister? My friends and I, we fought it once. Defying fate, huh? Just like Kuja, only he's a lot of wrong... Only he's done a lot of wrong in his life. If torsions distort reality, that means there's a chance we can use them to change the fate of our worlds. But what about all the monsters that come out of them? We also still don't know what the true nature of these torsions. I think we should forget about this, this and put our trust in Mog for now. Kuja's plan. Vivi Zidane, that man Kuja, he's from your world, right? Oh. Gaia, yeah, that's where we're from. Though I can't necessarily say the same for him. And you have absolutely no idea what he could be after. I think he's afraid of dying. Kuja likely thinks that 
by creating torsions and warping reality he can defy fate. So he's motivated by a fear of death and he fights to change his destiny. It doesn't matter what his reasons are. The fact remains that he hurt people to get what he wants. He must be stopped. What he's doing is left unchecked. If left unchecked, will affect all our worlds. Besides, it's not our sympathy he's after. Alright. Vivian's done. Looks like we're back at the ruins. May the hunt for Kuja begin. Should have done this one towards the beginning. Everything okay? You seem lost in thought back there. I'm fine. Let's just keep going. If you say so, you've done great so far, you know. For that, I have you and everyone else to thank. I never could have done anything on my own. Even with the light, I don't think I can save the world. I'm not strong like any of you. Trust me, you're just as strong as any of us. You have a reason to fight, and so long as you keep reminding yourself of it, you'll find you have the power to save our, any world. Thanks, Zidane. You always know what to say. I've been thinking, if the reason we can close torsions is because of the light, how does Kuja do it? I don't know. He shouldn't have the light. He's done a lot of bad things. Yeah. But it's no use talking about it. For now, we just need to focus on finding him. The Hume Boy. <laughs> hey, that's your airship? Who's asking? Oh, me, I'm Vaughn, and that's a really cool airship. Finally, someone who understands and is not just for show. It's fast, safe, and comes with the best pilot you've ever met. I know a good airship when I see one, so it's yours, huh? Since when did you become the owner? I got us that ship. Oh yeah, I almost forgot to ask. Where am I? You're just now wondering that, Koopo? What's the big deal? People get lost all the time when they're hunting. I can't be the first, so can you take me home in that airship of yours? I'm afraid it can't, it can't take you back to your world. My world? What are you talking about? Dimensional torsions have been appearing, connecting this world to others. We all come from another world, including you, apparently. Mm. We're not on Ivalice? I don't understand. <laughs> oh boy. Looks like we've got company. Be right back with you in a second, kid. <laughs> After this one, there's gonna be one more, and then that's it for this video. What was that all about? That monster just looked like me. We call them mannequins. We've already run into others just like our friends as well. It's true, Koopo. The world's being invaded by monsters. So we're on a journey to find new friends with that will of light with with the will of the light to stop them. And I can sense the light in you, Koopo. I get it, you're on a mission. But wouldn't it be easier to find and stop whoever's making these uh, torsions? We still don't really know who or what that is, Koopa. But we do know that monsters are using the torsions to, s to spread destruction throughout this world. Which is why we've been defeating the monsters to steal the torsions, Koopa. Yeah. Then let me come with you. I can't just look the other way when someone's in need of help. Arigato. Wonderful. We can use all the help we can yes. get. All right, all right, enough chit chat. Hey, kid, want a peek in the, at the engine? <laughs> Seriously? I hope he knows how important our mission is, Koopo. I'm sure he'll learn. Besides, a little optimism is a good thing. All right, last part, and then this will be it for this video. Love is in the air. Tifa, you like plays, don't you? You ought to come watch me perform sometime. I'm pretty talented. I even got the princess to cry once, and trust me, she's practically made of ice. Zidane, do you even understand the gravity of our situations? Now is really not the time. Aw, oh, come on, lighten up. 
we've still got a long trip ahead of us. So, Rim, I hear we're the same age. Do you have anyone you, you know, like? Hmm, not like per se, but there's someone I want to protect. Ah, uh, guess I don't stand a chance here. Hmm? Nothing. Zidane, you're a lot funnier than I ever gave you credit for. Of course I'm funny. What use would it be if I couldn't keep beautiful ladies like you entertained? Alright, that's going to be it for this video. This is uh, Chapter 2, Part 5. Um, sorry I didn't get to any of the stuff. I apologize. I actually deleted the video. But uh, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.